What we're looking at is a complete transformation of the way we see wireless networks today. So 4G was really all about communications with people and delivery of video. And with 5G, I think what we're going to see is a complete transformation where we're talking more about connectivity for machines so that they can transform our lives and deliver services um, much faster, much quicker than we could ever perceive today. With 4G today, there's higher latency in the network. So this is the amount of time it takes to transmit data from the device to the network and back again. With 5G, that communication path will allow you to communicate much quicker and you'll be able to control machines. So in this demonstration here today, we have um, this camera which is recording the position of this ball on this plate. And then this position is recorded by a mobile edge cloud computing environment that then is intelligently controlling these robots, sending them the commands across the network to balance this ball on the plate. In this first demonstration, you can see on the screen here behind me, we're showing the current latency of what would be a 4G network. It's around 90 to 100 milliseconds. And on the right-hand side, you'll be able to see this line move as we move the ball on the plate. So what I'm going to do is move this ball right now, and we can see the oscillations here tracked on this graph and how long it takes for the robots to collaborate with each other to get the information they need to balance the ball on the plate. And then we're going to switch into 5G mode. And we can see on this graph here that we've now gone from around 90 milliseconds to around 3 milliseconds, so much, much lower latency in the network. And I'm going to do exactly the same again. And we can see that we only took one oscillation there to correct the ball. So you can see how the reduction of the latency in the network improves the communication between the machines, which is critical for future networks. I think for society, for humanity as a whole, what we're going to see is a transformation of our um, existing technologies to automate everything. So you can imagine healthcare, automotive, or in the mining industry, or in other areas that are very uh, critical or dangerous for humans, we can actually send a machine in and actually control them remotely over a 5G wireless network because of that low latency in the network. So uh, a huge transformation in the way we utilize our, our network and what we're able to control and do with our machines.